family how you are doing hope you are good how's your night how's your family your friends loved ones who are around you hope you all are good this coral period yeah i know that it's not easy but let's just try to you know hang on god will help us in jesus name so today's video i'm just getting right into it no long story so lots of you might have noticed this shiny shiny on my tip it's not fancy, it's not jewelry, it's not diamond, it's not silver. It's called braces. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm going to be really quick with this video. I really, really pray it's not too long. So let's get right into to this gist. So majorly I'll be talking about the cost, the duration, and basically the process of getting um braces done in Nigeria, whether in the private hospital or in the federal hospital so number one the cost if you want to get your braces done you need to have like a budget of what to be really really real from 200,000 naira to let's say 500,000 naira that's the range that is the range and if it's if you do your braces in a federal hospital it's actually way cheaper than in a private hospital but if you want to do your braids in a private hospital it's i think it's actually better if you have the funds because the process is faster and it's less stressful and okay so that is that for the budget for me i got my braces done in university of benin teaching hospital at the orthodontist um, clinic and as at that time it was 200,000 for me getting my fixed appliances it was 180 170 then 30,000 era to you know do the scan that's majorly the that's just the the range i think it's um more expensive now i think that's what my dentist told me said it's it's more expensive now so budget aside and why i got my braces done is that i had overbites so an overbite is when your upper jaw is overlapping the lower jaw so it was like this and i had space like space 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 all over my teeth it was really wide so i had to correct that so yeah that's basically the reason why i got braces done and the duration initially braces are supposed to like it depends on the condition of your teeth mine was supposed to last me like two years but i traveled to i started schooling in Iwo and traveling down to benin so it was not really easy because of the distance and you know security reasons so i i always um came home maybe during um the holiday season and maybe i'll just take um exercise or permission from school to come home for um checkup initially i was supposed to go for my checkup every four weeks but that was not possible and that um should i say increase now that extended my that extended the you know period that i was supposed to wear my braces it's looking a lot better now before my teeth was terrible <laughs> It was really terrible like i i didn't smile often because i was insecure about my teeth i'm going to be really honest i was really insecure about my looks my teeth because sometimes when i smile when i talk people will be like oh did you lose a tooth oh why is your teeth like that and in primary school and in secondary school people also made fun of me because of my teeth <laughs> boohoo imagine people making fun of anita <laughs> It was actually really painful. It was a painful experience. Um, people can be really mean sometimes. Like people can be really terrible. They make you feel bad with their words and all. That aside, I'm no longer insecure about anything again. But I had major insecurities back then. So that was the the main reason, part of the reasons actually, why I got my braces done. Okay, so the processes of getting your braces done. First of all, you obviously have to go to the dentist they will assign you to like to your own dentist and to your own consultant so back then in 2016 december when i got my braces done 
you know they did um they checked my blood i went for x-ray you know different things and yeah after that they asked me to come back in two weeks time so i went back to the orthodontist clinic and you know they started <laughs> ah i really don't like visiting the dentist but we go there all right so the first thing that they did was um scaling and polishing they just cleaned my teeth and all then the second thing was that they um inserted like a tiny um elastic like elastic band it was really really small like so small they placed it in between my gums just to you know create space for the fixed appliances and that lasted for um a week it was really painful i'm not going to lie so i went back to the orthodontist clinic and they took it out and they started the you know the let's say technique now they started fixing little um little bands is it little bands now brackets yes that is the name so the tiny metals placed on my teeth is called brackets and it was applied using a um they call this bonding dental dental bond i can't remember the name and this process it took like two hours so imagine my mouth was opened for two hours i they used the mouth guard so process lasted for two hours and before sorry i forgot to mention this before they started fixing the brackets they did something called impression that is to get the like casting to get the i, I, I can't really find the right word to use so they did something like impression on my teeth they mixed one um i don't know what to call it concussion it looks like toothpaste but it's way way thicker so they um, use it to get like an impression a model of my teeth like a sample so that was <laughs> it was really uncomfortable i almost choked it was really uncomfortable but they had to do that so that you know they will know okay this is how my teeth was before i got braces and you know just to compare so another thing they did was to take a photo of my my fish uh, my facial features and my teeth before my jaw was not like this my i think i will insert a picture by the side the way my jaw was before it was <laughs> i don't know how to, to describe it. i'll just insert a picture so you know how it is and so basically that that is it so you just have to you know keep to your appointments and i'm really thankful to god that i'm at home now and i'm always going to my dentist every two weeks or three weeks depending on um the appointment dates that she gives me this my <laughs> my braces journey has been a very very stressful one emotional one as well because i'm always having toothache and it's painful sometimes so maybe in another video i'll talk about the misconceptions that people have about um braces let me just chip this in here. It is not a fashion statement. I've had people walking up to me like older people saying, uh, children of nowadays, why, why are you putting this in your mouth? And, and is it the new fashion thing? I don't blame them. It's just plain ignorance. They don't know. That is why. So it's my it's left for me to you know explain to them that, oh, no, this is not, this is not a fashion statement. So I'll address that later. That is the end of the video. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed it. If um, you noticed anything during the course of the video, just let me know in the comment um, box. So please like, share, subscribe. Take care. Love you. Bye.